Hey guys, I have an art book to share with you today. It's called Paint, Play, Explore. It's expressive mark making techniques in mixed media. Okay, so let's get started and I can do a quick flip through for you guys so you can see what the book's all about. Now her color palette is very bright and playful. She starts by talking about the conventional tools that you're going to need. And then she talks about the paint and the mediums and the substrates. And then she goes into unconventional tools that you can use to put a mark. Pretty much you can use anything though. It's very abstract. Here are some basic marks. And she goes step by step to show you her process. And of course you can always use your fingers. Now here she shows you how to create a stain using raspberry juice. There's lots of step by step in here so you're, you're not lost. You can actually see what she does. And here uh, she shows you how she sews on her paper. I love an art book that has so much detailed instructions. I love to see the process. This book is a really nice size. There's lots of information. So many techniques in this book. I can hear the birds outside right now. I don't normally uh, gra gravitate towards these colors, but I can get inspiration from this, from these different techniques. You can use any colors you want. You don't have to use the colors that she uses in this book, but this, like this purple right here, I love this dark purple. But you can use a light purple. You can use pastels or fall colors, whatever whatever you like, but this is basically a great technique book. She shows you how it's done. Now I love this, how she sewed all these different pieces of art together. This is a very fun book. That's how I would describe this book. It's very fun and it's, it shows you, um, just be playful and use whimsy. I love whimsical art. It doesn't have to actually look like a flower. It can give you the impression that it's a flower. Um, and it's your flower. It doesn't, have to, it doesn't have to be a masterpiece. It can just be fun. So I think this is a great, a great book for if you, um, this, is a, this is good for beginners, I would say to not advanced because this kind of this is kind of a how to for, for for beginners on how to start making marks if you're an advanced artist i think you know all of this stuff anyway but i think it's a great starter book it this is great for somebody starting out who needs a little bit of guidance uh, this is a great book and this is a great addition to my collection because you guys all know that I collect art books. So yep, I do recommend this book and I will leave a link below for you guys and I hope you enjoyed this video. See you guys later. Bye!